Down Los Angeles. Two-man game with George and Zoo. Paul George off the window and knocks it. A multitasking line for him. Five points, four rebounds, and an assist. George creates space and then knocks down the three, and the Clippers lead by a dozen. Seven ten-point leads this season. They've won every one of those games. And there they go again. Nice deflection right there. And the pull-up from downtown for Paul George. He is not disappointed. 13 for number 13. But you look at the defense, and I said it. Right in the Bruder, challenging him. Nice deflection. There's a very good defensive unit on the floor. Everybody flattens out right there, and that's a nice pull-up, which made it look, you know, really obvious. But he's picked it up to his credit. George with the step away, knocks it in. If you're not counting at home, I'll do it for you. He has 15 points. And Jones, did he miss that shot? I just love the pace. I love the pace that the Clippers are playing with right now. That allows you to get those kind of open shots. You run it, running a play that hasn't been run all game, or even if it is a play that you've been running. Fortunate play right there. Nice finish right there by Montrez. Hawks are 7 of 12 in this second quarter. Clippers just 1 for 8. Quick move for Trez. It's a triple. A seismic slam, and he shakes the Southland. And I like how he didn't, he didn't waste any time right there. George, the drive, the dish. Get out, get out, get out. Two man game with man for the corner three. He loved it the second it left his hand. Here, did a good job. Nice pump fake. This is textbook basketball. You got Paul George wide open. You're hot player. This to Trey Young. The actual assist goes to Len. Clippers lead cut down to 11. George got it again. His third, make it his fourth three of the half. He will fire from anywhere, as you just seen. Lee trimmed into single digits. Paul George spots an entry to the rim, hit hard, counted in a foul, and send him to the line. Bang. You need to get fouled really hard just to know, you know what? My shoulder's feeling just fine. Nice play by Paul George. So Chauncey in 39 minutes. Overhearing Lou Williams and Doc Rivers talk as Paul George gets the pass and hands a three. 31 for Paul George. And here he's going to have to keep this up. But this is who he was all of last year. Counted on a foul and send him back to the line. Put him in any action. You can isolate him. You look at him right here coming off of a high. This is the Los Angeles Clippers. Paul George is out there. He's only played 18 minutes. Flings a three. He has six threes tonight. Probably another month or so with a suspension on there. Paul George, make us proud. Bounces off the backboard. Ho ho. Montrez Harrell does the rest. The saying defense to offense, Clipper fans. That's what you're going to see all year long. Thanks a lot, Brian. Paul, these fans have been waiting to officially welcome you home. They made noise for you at introductions. They made noise for you when you checked out with 37 points tonight. What does this moment like for you? It means everything. Uh, I mean, I, I couldn't wait to get in front of this crowd. I couldn't wait to uh, be home, play at home. Um, you know, this is, I can get used to this. <laughs> In your first outing, you actually said you thought you played terrible after 33 points on 17 shots. You put up 37. That's 70 points through two games. Can you give yourself a better evaluation tonight? Um, I, I thought I was better. I thought, um, you know, I had a better flow. My body felt better. My legs felt better. Um, I was actually able to just move. I thought the first game, everything was so fast-paced and it was coming at me quick. Uh, whereas this game, I felt conditioned. I felt ready um, coming into it. And, um, you know, my guys helped me along the way. On the scoring end, you make it look effortless. But I know it wasn't effortless to get to this moment. It took a lot of time and a lot of energy for you rehabbing. Describe that process and what it means to be back. Long process, long process. I mean, honestly, I've been rehabbing since uh, middle of May. Um, you know, and, and, and it's been long and hard. Um, but I had a great team around me uh, who really pushed me and helped me along the way. Uh, it's, good job. Uh, but you know, it's, it's tough. Anybody that go through rehab, it's, it's, it's tough. But you got to take it one day at a time. And, um, you know, you just got to stay with it. We've seen glimpses of what this team could do in the early goings of the season, shorthanded tonight. But how dangerous can you guys be when you're at full strength? Really dangerous, really dangerous. You know, we got three guys in our starting group that is out right now. And, um, you know, it's... it's 
we just got to pull for one another. Whoever's in, whoever's out, we got to pull for them. Um, you know, this is a team that's that's looking forward to play deep in the season. So um, it's about coming out here, being healthy, and um, taking care of our bodies. All right, Palmdale's own PG-13.